Good morning and welcome to the session on cyber security. Uh, today is the first session. Uh, so I'll give an introduction on uh, what is hacking and the various concepts of hacking. And then we will go on to uh, the other parts and the other modules which um, I will be telling you as the slides keep coming. So today's major topic will be on ethical hacking. So let us, before we start talking about ethical hacking, let us understand what hackers are. So we can say hackers are here and where are you? The explosive growth of internet has brought many good things. As with most technological advances, there is also a dark side, that is the criminal hackers. The term hacker has a dual usage in computer industry today. Originally, the term was defined as a person who enjoys learning the details of computer system and how to stretch their capabilities. Secondly, it is also defined as one who programs enthusiastically or who enjoys programming rather than just theorizing about programming. So these are very general definitions of hackers. So we can say that somebody had quoted with our dependence on computers and computing systems growing stronger every day and rapidly quickening pace of software and device capabilities I will explain why ethical hacking is necessary and must have that needs to be understood and applied for the good of the community. Basically what he means here is that uh, uh, hacking should be used for a good cause, not for a bad cause or with, a, with some kind of criminal intentions. Now what are the problems? actually in society people don't have knowledge about ethical hacking when the word hacking is used immediately people start thinking about certain negative things that the hacker would be doing now with the advancement of computer technology there are various ways of understanding hacking though knowledge amongst people is very less. 